The word blind change? Oh, this is is this Alpha? Krisa, Krisa, Krisa. Oh shit! This is. Yo! Okay, episode seven, and yeah, <laughs> I never thought that I would see this scene over all over again. And definitely, Okabe. Man, it seemed like all of that effort that he had from the Alpha World line was for nothing. So who's going to die? Definitely not Mayuri. And what are they after now? Are they still after? But the thing is, Okabe doesn't have any time machine now. Oh, is it Moika? Again? Kiryu Moika? Is it, is it her again? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and Souza is, is not prepared for this. But is it really Kiryu Moika? They're not showing the face for a reason. Oh, they're after um, Shina Kaguri. And definitely, Mr. Brown is part of this. Because he seems suspicious when... Because he, he was asking when the party will end or something. Yeah, I don't think Mayuri will die here. Because we've confirmed from Suzuha that she survived in the future. Ooh, oh, maybe the Kag the Kagari here will die. Because there's still that. Oh, Brown. Oh. So he's not part of this group. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. Ooh, who is she? I'm assuming she's not Kiryu because they're not showing her face. Because if that's Kiryu, they'll... They'll just show her face ev eventually. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, so I guess this time it's not about the IBN. I guess it's not about the time machine. But more about Shina Kagari. So those people knew Kagari definitely came from the past. Or maybe she's related to Makise. Because she's exactly like her. Oh, so Mr. Brown is just a normal guy. Oh no. Because <laughs> if, if it's, cause I guess even if it's Kiryu, it's still possible it's Kiryu Moika that is involved. Because she's the only one, I guess, who knew. Oh, makes sense. It, it, it's possible it's Kiryu Moika. Because she's the only one who knew that. They already have Shina Kagari. I think she's the one to, who reported it to someone else. The ones that has been looking for Shina Kagari. Yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. But how? So maybe someone... So from the future as well because no it's not I don't think it's I don't think it's the CERN now or maybe yeah I guess we're not, we're not sure yet yeah I think it's still Kiryu Moika because she's the only one who had the information And that's why the the professor and the other girl that Hyajon knew came to the shrine themselves. I guess just to confirm that she's there or something. Or maybe I'm missing something. Yeah. 
out. <laughs> oh man. At but at least this time no one really died. Oh man. It's it's like reliving all of those things all over again. But I guess this is some kind of motivation now for for Okabe to finally get his things back together. Cause he cause right now he's just he's satisfied, somewhat satisfied with what's happening. And I understand that, especially after all that trauma, that stress that he has went through. And for final and to accept that Makise has to die. So he has really a lot of things going through. But I think now it seems like the his fate is somewhat forcing him to do something. Oh <laughs> I think it's definitely But at least the good thing is he is not part of that. I guess that's what makes the professor and her other colleague a lot more unsuspicious is is because of Hiajo. But I think now that they've somewhat hinted that Oh, there's a camera. Something Does someone get maybe hacked? But I think it's only the only possibility is that Moika cause, cause she's the only one that Okabe has told about that they found Shina Kagari. Cause they wouldn't know that who Shina Kagari is unless Suzuha confirms who it is because I think th no one has really seen her no one is familiar with her face oh but it makes sense because Kagari came to their family first so maybe maybe that's that's why they have cameras is to protect to protect Shina Kagari so maybe Rukako's father knows something. Yep. <laughs> she's yeah she's picking up some weird things and she's calling Roka big brother yeah but I think they need to know now especially that everything is going fast now and I think the it start it's all it's all starting to happen now I think that's the thing that Okabe has to, everyone has to realize is that they need everyone to participate. Yeah. Because before at the Alpha World, Okabe was the one who's just keeping all the things all, 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 all by himself. And then eventually, yes, 
the only reason the only way he was able to solve those things is because of the help of others mayuri krisu daru <laughs> oh, what if he's still... Yeah, I guess maybe he's still part of CERN or something. Oh, he seemed look... He seemed... He, he looked serious. I guess now it's something seems like they going he's going to get some help from the CERN. Is he going to have the help of CERN now? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, are they going? Yeah, I think Okarin has to tell. But I guess the thing is, it's really hard to believe. Ooh. Oh, it's her. Whoa, it's her. That's why she knew about Kagari. Oh. So she's in a different faction than the CERN. So it's going to be different factions now. Ooh. Who are the ones who attack? Oh man, that's so messed up. Oh. But ha I, I guess they never revealed how Suzuha knew her mother. Oh. <laughs> Yep, your witnesses now. 
Yep, you're right. Ooh. Man, this should be the part of the season of... I guess this is a, like a season prequel of C uh, Steins Gate. Man. Oh, she's listening. Because this has... This this is this this has made the situation of the last episode a lot more has a a lot more into it than Oh man Oh now he's getting the <laughs> the help of CERN I guess this is not really I guess this is eventually about the time machine. Ooh, I think that faction is the fa fash fash. Oh, they're f they're from the U.S. Ooh, yeah, I remember now. Yeah, definitely the U.S. will be involved once that they learn that Russia's that kind of technology. Ooh, the arm straits are starting. But how did they knew about Kagari in the first place? Oh, and how how come Suzo's mother is connected to them? Oh, she I, is she the Cuz she is she's the same person that Okabe met at the LA Los Angeles in the US, so she also came from the US. Oh, and then she, she eventually tried to be a part of the circle of Okabe. I guess through. through. Um, Ferris. Yeah, K6 to survive. What is it? For militaries. Yeah. Yeah, the US is involved. Amadeus Amadeus Oh Amadeus I guess they Oh, she knew the code Oh, Amadeus. Why do you think it's her? Oh, maybe she's trying. She's trying. Oh, she's trying. Oh. 
Whoa, what change? Oh, it changed. Oh, I'm getting chills. Oh. <laughs> okay, post credit scene. Ooh. Oh, where is he? Where is he? I forgot the number. I didn't notice the number of the. Oh, it's a D mail. Yeah, up there. The word line change? Oh, is this is this Alpha? Krisa, Krisa, Krisa. Oh shit! This is the oh shit! He came back. He came back to the Alpha. Oh man, how could they not include this in the season? Oh man, they could have just continued it. They, I think they shouldn't have ended the first season of Steins Gate. I guess it would, pro it would prolong the, the story. But, but I guess I, I'm not sure. Maybe this happened that, this happened after a few years after the Steins Gate. But man, the the situation. Oh man, he came back. Yeah, I guess maybe Amadeus wasn't supposed to meet Okabe on that world line. But I guess that's the weird thing is that because eventually it will create uh Yeah, I'm still not, I'm still kind of confused on how how did that trigger the 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 time the reading Steiner. Cuz if this is the alpha, definitely I think this is the alpha. But uh, let me just check the number. But I still don't remember the, the previous number of the alpha. Man, cause this is, cause that's the only thing that that I'm thinking about is that. Oh, they didn't show the number. So, it's either this is alpha or another beta line, beta world line. But it wouldn't make sense if that's the case, cause it would. I think it would complicate things a lot more. If they make another world line so the only possible thing is this is the alpha alpha world line where okabe deleted the deleted the um, deleted the the connection uh, when Dar removed the connection using the ibn 300 to the cern and so what made Okabe go back to that place is definitely because um, Amadeus called him and we, we all, I already mentioned before that um, with regards to the new, new neurons of a person the memories that um, even though Amadeus is just a collective memories of Crystal um, even if it's just considered something like an AI I think it's still her it still has her memories and we've already proven that through Okabe that it's still the same person so yeah I guess that call by Ahmed Amadeus calling Okabe to help him triggered something changed something Ooh, I wonder why how well, I guess they will explain it later on but the thing is that yeah they 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 also hinted who's the possible um the ones who attacked them. So definitely it's Suza's mother. Um what was her name again? Cause they they, they, they wouldn't show that uh, part where her hand was somewhat broken because we've seen that um Suzuha attacked her. And there's a there's a reason they're not showing her face because if if it's just Kirio Moika, she would just, just remove the, the helmet. But it wouldn't make sense for them to attack them because I don't know how he's connect how how because I don't think Cern is connected to her. But I yeah, but yeah, I guess he's still uh, Moika is still part of the rounders. But the thing is that there are different faction and um, I think 
Uh, I'm not sure what is Mr. Brown looking for. I guess he's still he's he's, he's just an agent based on in this place in Japan, and he has this group of people. But they they don't have any reason to, um, to target Okabe and his group because, um, with regards to the time machine. So, because I think the only reason, um. Mr. Brown has been connected to Okabe after all that is because of the the moment where um, Daru hacked into CERN. So CERN, CERN was able to track down the same way um, this, uh, Okabe's lab. And that's how, I guess, they learned the, the information that um, Okabe has been able to develop a time machine. But right now, Okabe has nothing. He doesn't have a time machine except for the one that Suzu has. Suzu has brought from the future so yeah there's no really no reason for them to capture Okabe because he's not really connected to the time machine except for Makise I think that's why Kurisu and that's why I think um, the Amadeus project started in the first place is because uh, remember in this timeline uh, Makise's father who killed her got the papers and went to um, was it Russia or something and he has the papers in order to create a time machine and definitely um, US spies has some information maybe on the Russia and they learned that where that maybe in where where they could also get that information or that uh, data in the in, in the, with regards to creating a time machine so maybe that's why they started I guess they also made some research or they learned that if Makise created that um, data and they have this Amadeus project that she created, I guess they, they started or her theory with regards to the this AI and yeah, this this group of, um, I guess it's it's probably um, Hiyajo started this project and maybe she just got help from the professor and definitely that professor and that other girl that were following Hiyajo definitely they're, they're somewhat connected maybe to the CIA or something like that from the US and maybe that's why they're monitoring this project through Hiyajo because if they are able to replicate Maki Sekirisu her memories I guess 7 days old definitely that Maki Se will eventually be able to formulate again the time machine the yeah the the formula in creating a time machine so i think that's what what they're hoping for but maybe the missing piece in order to create to fully complete makise is to have shinakagari because they wouldn't make shinakagari look exactly like makise for a reason but the confusing thing the the, the mysterious thing about that that she came from the future as a child so how come she was a child from the future and yeah she came back with suzuha so that's the th mysterious thing still for me is she a clone did they, did, did they were they able to uh, finally um create a clone of makise and that's why they have that girl in the future and um um, Mayuri adopted her so that's the thing and how come they knew about Kagari um, that fashion I guess they're st still not clear who are they it's just my uh, theory or my suspicion is that they're from the US kind of organization that is apart from CERN because we finally now confirmed that Mr. Brown he's still part of the CERN but he, they're not the ones they're not really targeting Okabe or anything and they but I guess if um, Kiryo Moika is still part of Mr. Brown, so they heard about Shinakagari. So there's a part, I guess that's their connection with regards to all of this is that, yeah, with regards to Shinakagari. So she's the, she's the, like the focal point in this world line compared to the uh, Alpha world line where the focal point is, I guess it's still Makise. It's still Makise. Except for that time world line, it's about the IBN three IBN, was it three hundred? Yeah. So, yeah, things are getting a lot more. Uh, it's, it's 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 escalating a lot, a lot more now. But yeah, but I guess it's somewhat 
uh, slowed down when the Mr. Brown came and stopped the the intruders and yeah Suzuha was able to protect them a little bit and injured the the one who seems like their leader and definitely uh, they wouldn't show that scene from the cafe uh, for a reason without a reason so I'm definitely sure that Suzuha's mother is the one who attacked them but what is her connection what is her group and I guess and also another possible thing is that maybe she knew from the beginning that she knew that Suzwa is her is her daughter so yeah and they never revealed how Suzuha knew I guess maybe Suzuha met her mother before but I guess she could she should have she she could have tell Suzuha that she was part of an organization before if in that if that's the case so yeah there's that's the confusing thing is that if how come she's part of that group and yeah and she's Suzo's mother so that's the confusing thing unless they're just trying to troll us or confuse us with regards to her being that uh that woman who attacked them because yeah they showed it um let me just check again that scene yeah she hit her in the uh, left wrist so exactly where um suzo's mother had the bandage and somewhat like broken who the mysteries <laughs> in this uh, episode oh man oh and she seems innocent as well i guess but yeah the thing is kira moika was really suspicious from the steins gate uh, from the from the previous season so you kind of sense that she's uh she's there's some she's hiding something but but with um Suzu's, Suzu's mother we wouldn't expect anything from her until this moment so they showed her left at least so man how crazy would that be oh i think Suzu would be heartbroken and even daru so maybe that changes a lot of things man i'm still confused with her with regards to that and yeah with that reveal <laughs> oh man is definitely that's my only that's my only prediction is she's he's in alpha alpha world line because it wouldn't make sense for makise to be in that lab room again if it's a different world line because they would never they would have never met or something Ooh, I'm so excited to go back to Steins Gate all over again. And I guess this time he could get information again from Makise to in order to figure out things. But definitely but the thing is if he's in back in Be Alpha World Line, it means Ma Mayuri is dead. So Oh man, now I wonder how they will drop these things up. Because there's already a lot of twists and turns just from this ep from episode 7 and the coolest thing is that this is a continuation of episode 21 or 22 of Okabe getting back to the beta world line where Makise has to die so whoa, I'm so excited for this uh, for this season oh man so yeah those are my thoughts on this episode in this episode if you think i have missed some details or maybe my but just don't please don't spoil anything for me that would be uh really sad and yeah it would it would drop the excitement from me but yeah i guess just just share your thoughts on this episode when you were first watching it and um i guess don't tell me if my theories are wrong or or are are they on point because that would spoil at the same time so yeah just share your thoughts um 
did you like my reaction to this episode just leave, just leave a like in the just click the like button down below and subscribe if this is your first time here so you'll be updated whenever i upload my reaction videos and also if you want to watch my my reaction to the next episode you could also do that it is now available on my patreon in the link in the description down below and you would also be able to um, request an anime that is not part of my anime reaction right now on my patreon and it will really help support my channel and help me create more reaction videos like this in the future so thank you again for watching see you in my next video have a great day goodbye